We are live from Fist Energy Stadium here in Cleveland, Ohio, home of the Cleveland Burns, where there's smoke, there's fire, and there's plenty of smoke up here in the booth. We are in for a barn burner today. Oh, that's coming from the toilets in the men's room. They're on fire again. I'll tell you, this is not an aroma I'm fond of, Graham. Like Limburg and cheese fondue gone bad. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers. The Malice Hellboys take on the Cleveland Burns. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Welcome to MFL Sunday School, where the good playbook teaches it's an eye for no reason, a tooth for an eight ball, and a limb for just looking at me the wrong way. MFL game day is on the air. Grim Blitzrow, my partner's Bricks and Bricks Jr. Hey, man, these guys flat out want to kill each other today. Yeah, these are the kind of games families come out to see. It's good for the sport. You know what I like about this home team is 90% of them were born criminally insane. You can't teach that. And it's first and ten. A pickup of about three on that play. Second down and seven. He picks up five on that play. Third and two. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Man, this guy just exploded into flames. Now the defense has to try to tackle a running bonfire. Well, that's the end of his day. Looks like he had a bad case of the worms. Oh, uh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> that's why I love this guy. And so do the fans. And it's first and ten. Hot one. Hot. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Second down and ten. Third down and, well, good luck. He broke free and has open field in front of him. And like a monkey trying to fuck it. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. That's a four-yard gain. Second down and six. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. And they stack the line and he gets his bell rung for a yard. Third down and five. Hot, hot one, hot two. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. The drive was stalled, and here comes the field goal attempt. He is automatic. Nice kick. Boring. Just get the points, and let's move on. 
Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And it's first and ten. And that player just transforms. Oh, and he fumbles the ball on that hit. When you hurdle and get hit, chances for a fumble increase. Second down and six. With a burst of speed, he finds an opening and the first down. And it's first and ten. And the defense gets the quarterback for a sack. Second down in a lot. One speed engaged. When he tries to place it, not badly. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? Third down and ten. Looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. I don't understand why they're going for it, Grim. This seems like the situation where they should always... And he just used his beast boost dirty trick, and there's no way to stop him. Unless, of course, you kill him. Wow, look at that freak go. He's unstoppable. Oh. He only kept it on the ground and got a much-needed conversion. Much and the ref just called a bullshit penalty. Yeah. Oh boy, there. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not gonna take it anymore. If they don't pick it up, he often says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Oh, boy, they're going for it. This could get uglier than the baby resulting from an orcish family reunion. And they get stumped cold. Hey, Grim, remember what I said when Briggs wanted to bring in a fish buffet in our tiny air seal broadcast booth? I believe that was. Who could have thought that was a good idea? Yeah, just checking. I'm thinking that again. First and eight to go. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. First and ten. Go 
come out about a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. Just follow the bloody footprints to the new line. That's a first down. And it's first and ten. heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole up here. Talking to you. Oh, look at this guy break tackle. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. Third down and eight. gonna hurt he may not be able to comprehend math after that hit what's math that's the end of quarter one well the good news is there's still time to make it a game and there's still time to get a beer and it's first and ten and they run it for a couple of yards And that'll be second and eight to go. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was on to the races. Ghost <laughs> Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called set straight through the uprights. <laughs> They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. <laughs> oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. Shot treatment work? Well, after she killed four of the doctors and Zapter, they never bothered her again. So, yeah, I, I guess it worked for her. And that'll bring up third and one. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. He had nowhere to go and got nothing out of it. <laughs> and the putter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is superb, Grim. That cross stitching, unbelievable. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. And he just slipped away like a grease. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. And it's first and ten. Gets the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it.
was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. First and four. It's two yard run before he stopped. Second down and two. And here comes the extra point attempt. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for you. You know what? Never mind. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. Hot one, hot two. Hot Good thing you have a drug test in the NFL, because whenever they... Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. That's a killer. It was right there and then he dropped it. Ah, oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. Third down and the offense needs a miracle. Hot one, hot two, hot. And he picked up a lot of real estate in a hurry. Give him 10 yards right there. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he put all of his foot into that one. He's got the foul with the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. I'm going to say maybe three yards, but a tough three yards. Second down and seven. Four yards on that one. And he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Third and four. Man, he shoveled his feet so well on that play. He should go to lost wages and deal cards. First down! And they take their first time out. Uh, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the time out during halftime. And it's first and ten. And he held on to that one for a first down. The quarterback is controlling the clock like the clock is into it. I know I am. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Ben, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense... Oh, man, he ran... And that pass finds its target. A pickup of six yards on the play. And that'll be... And that'll be their final timeout. out. 
And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brent's match stopsing time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. <laughs> Third and four. I'm pretty sure my baby sister can throw further than that, but she doesn't have to play against goddamn monsters. And the defense won that one handily. The offense fails on fourth down and turns the ball over. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot. Nicely done for a first down. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room, and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. It's the start of the third quarter, and we are set to go, Bricks. Oh, boy! Where we going, Grim? A carnival? Hey, why don't you settle down? Just pet your rabbit, Lenny. Just pet your rabbit. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chick wearing a wig. a run for no gain. Second down and ten. And the defense just called the ginormous dirty trick. His big ass will probably show up on the radar. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Defense holds him to a four-yard pickup there. <laughs> Second down and six. The defense better look out. The offense called the beast boost dirty trick. There's no reason to drop the ball if you're still alive. loves punishing the defenders. That's a first. It appears that the ref just received a pair of very expensive alligator skin shoes. They need to put some cement shoes on them before this game slips away. I always wanted a pair of alligator skin shoes, Grim. I heard, though, when you put them on, they feel just like chicken skin shoes. Second down and more. And they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Third down, and the QB is saying his prayers. And Bricks, they just made up a whole lot of field in a hurry with that pass play. For a sandwich. Well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Ouch! What is this, Andy's wrestling? <laughs> And it's 
First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. First down. He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. Second down in a very lot. One, hot two, eight. And then Katz will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, eight. And like every one of my barbecues, this guy's on fire. Does he like original? First down! Yeah, my next door neighbor was a human cannonball, Grim. He drowned in his pool. First down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot eight. Looks like he just ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. Second down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. Third down and nine. Hot, hot one. Eight. He blasted and picks up seven yards right there. They are going for it, and the defense is licking their mutant lips. Oh, great tackle! When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. And he picks up about six on the play. And that'll be second down and four. And a hard run there picks up the first down. And it's first and ten. And the running game is starting to click now. A pickup of eight on the play. Second down and two. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And it's first and ten. And they'll keep the drive alive as he rifles it in there and picks up seven yards. Quarter three comes to an end, but this game is far from over and will be decided in the final quarter. Second and three. That was a nice piece of running, Grim. That's a first down. And it's first and ten. for a first down. And it's first and ten. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. Yeah, we 
get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. Second down and ten. The defense better watch out. The quarterback just threw a murder ball. And he catches it for a touchdown. What a beautiful play. Yeah, it's on those power and green like a high cool. Should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. That's a gain of ten yards. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Hot, Sorry, partner. Hot two, hot. When the defense calls Thunderclap, the offense is toast. Oh, did he ever get zapped? Reminds me, you ever hear that Zappa song, Watch Out Where the Huskies Go? Don't you eat that yellow snow? When I was a kid, I always ate the yellow snow. They were like lemon snow cones. But them fudge ice cream sandwiches, eh, they didn't taste so good. It's about a three-yard pickup. Second down and seven. Hot. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And the rumor is going crazy fast. Look at the pass. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. And that'll bring up third down and seven. Hot one, hot. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Boom! And it's first and ten. Quarterback calls a sonic blast. Holy crap, he runs straight into a mutant trap and dies. Reminds me of my breakfast cereal, the old nut crunch. First down and three. Hot, hot one, hot two. But he drove out of the field in a brand new hearse.
They're back up here on first. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. First down and forever. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hey. Oh, great pass on that play. They caught the defense napping. Second down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot two. And the two-minute warning sounds. They'll have to regroup during this timeout. Second down and seven. Hot, hot one. Hey. You've got to catch that. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry up offense. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hey. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? And these guys think kicking is for pussies, Bricks. They're going for two. Yeah, they got big balls, Grim. Yeah, I'm thinking of yours. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. They're going to be able to return this one. This guy's a brick shit house. And it's first and ten. Talking about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Second down and ten. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. The defense calls their first time out to save some clock. I save clocks too, Grim. My wife hates them. They take up the whole garage. Wait, what? You're married? No, mm, it's complicated. Oh, ah, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him. The defense calls a second time out. They really need to make a stop here. And it's first and ten. And they line up for the extra point. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. to try to conserve time. Oh, and that 
one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? The quarterback burns his last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see it. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. Well, if you're into humiliation and scatological fetishes, this Burns Laws was right up your alley. Well, there's a waste of an afternoon if you're a Leland fan. But if you're from Leland, uh, that's what every day feels like, I suppose, so after you. They battled hard, but didn't have enough to get it done. They choked like a bunch of banana choking chimp chumps choking on a bag of chimp dicks. Did you just say choking on a bag of chimp dicks? Yeah. Yeah, that was beautiful. <laughs> Once again, the folks at Evil SM thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microheart Corporation. Make it a right.